Hello, my name is Eric Ford. I'm excited to introduce this new educational offering, the Primer on Radiation Oncology Physics. This covers all of physics as applied to the treatment of cancer patients. Uh, this is a textbook, but it, what's special about this is it also includes problems and a series of videos. And so this offers a rich combination for learning. The videos in particular are a strength here. There are over 60 of them, one for each section of the text. And I use a whiteboard technology to explain concepts, make drawings, I can draw equations. I can present graphs and I can draw over those graphs and I can demonstrate some of the clinical applications. So if you look over the table of contents, you'll see the scope is very comprehensive. We cover the fundamentals, uh, the application of these to some of the basics, and then on to clinical applications the therapy. In addition, there's some things covered uh, that may be unusual in a text like this, imaging, uh, other special procedures, particle beams, patient safety, and so on. So it's very comprehensive. And you'll see that in learning a broad content like this, it's very important to do problems. So this text includes hundreds of problems. Uh, the videos have quizzes embedded in them. So as you're watching, you can track your progress. And at the end of each chapter, there are also approximately 10 problems in each chapter. All told, then there are hundreds of problems in this series to work through. So altogether, then, this is a good support for the individual learner. There's the videos, the textbook, and the problems. But educators will also find this very helpful. This supports the so-called flipped classroom, where the content is viewed offline, and then class time is spent in discussion, doing problems, and deeper learning that goes with that. And data have shown that that's a more effective way to learn topics like this. So I do appreciate that physics is challenging. There's a lot of material here to learn. I believe this will be supportive and I think the effort is well worth it in the support of quality care for our patients. Thank you very much.